In terms of satisfying both client and team needs, one approach that we see more organizations taking is strategizing what their total experience is. So this is the idea that your employee experience or your EX and your customer experience, your CX, uh, shouldn't be siloed from one another and in fact to drive customer value and in particular quick customer uh, time to value requires closer coordination between your different teams, so between sales teams, customer success, finance and your delivery teams. Uh, in essence, long-term success on the CX isn't possible without the engagement uh, of your employees across those different value streams. And developing an ongoing culture of client success at that intersection of the EX and the CX is going to be very important going forward and that's potentially something that is going to require coaching and guidance around. It's really important to realize here that this isn't a trade-off, this isn't about either investing in your talent or in your client experiences. In fact, if as an organization you can move away from the idea that you know, value is essentially creating efficiencies project by project, and you can move on to the idea that really what you should be aiming for is to optimize around customer value and elevating the employee experience for your delivery and non-delivery teams, then the opportunity is to have each of these two things, the CX and the EX, optimize each other. Um, a lot of your success here is gonna come down to having a good technology strategy. Uh, we know from our research that uh, professional services individuals are more likely to be tech savvy than the average employee. They're more likely to be prioritizing, therefore, in their day-to-day -day, uh, experience, the quality of working in and out of different tools that's going to be more impactful for them in their overall engagement than it is for the average employee. And so, you know, as services businesses are obviously very people intensive, this is particularly important to think about to avoid talent attrition. I would say more specifically, companies should really be thinking about, you know, what are the uh, workflows, the collaboration and the reporting capabilities that can really ground stronger discussions between your delivery and non-delivery roles.